guys, my name is Zinthus, and this is a game called White Knight. I have no idea what this game is, however, it's a horror game. I have seen some trailers, it does look good. And how do you like my beard, by the way, as well? 18 days that, since I've shaved, and already I look like I'm about to be charged uh, with something. Never mind, so let's play White Knight. I hope you enjoy this, and obviously I'll be continuing with stairs and kidnapped alongside this when I can. There'll be a channel update coming soon as well because uh, it needs to happen. Here we go. Of course I want to play a new game. I haven't played this before, I have no choice. Activision. Osome Studio! Some nights are just pitch black. Without stars and without sleep. Dirty nights clinging to you like tar. Like this one night, back in 1938. Boston. The Great Depression tsunami was just sweeping over what was left of America. Misery, hunger, despair. Times are hard, they said. Times were worse than hard. And the bar was about to close. As far as I was concerned, this was just another intoxicated day drawing to an end. And you went driving. If only I knew. That drink driving was bad. Yeah, I love the, the comic style graphics of this. It adds such a charm to a game, almost, you know, a bit like Borderlands. Those games with cell shading, it's called. I don't think this is quite it, but it might be. It might just be a different take on it, but it's... <laughs> I like it, anyway. Those things will kill you. Right. Am I some sort of some sort of detective? Nah, who knows? Chapter one. Out of course. Is it out of course or is it out of course? Or is it Clearly not controlling anything at the moment. Technical director. Cool. Ah, that's the car. It's the back of the car. It's the windows, right? It's a very cute opening title sequence. Actually, isn't it? Boom, 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 boom. Sebastian Renard, Ronan Koif, Koth, Koifek, something. Ghost. 
the shock was still echoing in my bones, as the image of that girl coming out of nowhere surged back in my mind. Did I hit her? Was she dead? I couldn't remember. Thoughts were spinning in my head. I hope I didn't run her over. I hope she's still alive. Then, the pain. The terrible pain on my side. And this question. Where am I? Let's find out. Ah, oh, seriously, it's... I love the graphics. Well, you know, the graphics style. It's... It's, uh, it's lush. Oh, this is a whole new dimension to, you know... Being alone in the dark. Like the dark things are gonna appear bright. It's gonna be like a, you know, like it's almost like a negative camera effect with the light. Right. Okay. Well, I'm using the WSD. All right. So it's kind of a. Is it kind of a point and click game? Examine the place using space. The girl on the road, the impact. I, c I couldn't find her body. Right. Anything back in the car, actually. From the looks of things, dude, you're going to need some whiskey. Hey, this is pretty good, isn't it? This is pretty good. Yeah, man. The car was wrecked. I got lucky. Wow, so the in-game narration's in past tense. Okay. Yeah, this is a good point and click. I like this. I hope you're gonna like it as well. Alright, let's see. The box seemed to be connected to the electric lighting on, on the street. Really? That's all you're gonna say? Alright, let's follow the bloody trail, shall we? No body, no blood. Where did the girl disappear? Achievement unlocked. News of the day. Excuse the mouse, by the way, but um, it looks like I might need it. For help, I could rely on the Boston Daily News, which I could check with J. Alright. Vesper Manor. Didn't ring a bell. My head was empty and painful. Right. Okay, so this is kind of like a... Kind of a progress tracker, I guess. Did you waste it? I really like this! I haven't seen anybody play this. I'm sure they, ha they have if... when I YouTube after this to see if anybody has, but I haven't seen any playthroughs of this yet, actually. Vespa Manor. was trying to collect my thoughts, but the intense pain was scattering them like a bunch of dead birds. My fear of being wounded changed into an obsession. I'm back, baby. Was I about to die? Uh, well, yeah, car crashes do do this. Is that somebody? Uh, can't sit down, can we? statue. A graveyard in a garden. Really? Oh. 
I can't quite describe why this is actually a bit creepy. The statue was staring at me with a white and hostile stare. Bucket that have not been used for a long time. Alright, let's go to the house. Yeah, house. Margaret Vesper, born Ventacross. A bird table, nothing more. I assume if we check the other graves, um, it would be other Vesper family members. Presumably. That statue just doesn't look right from there. I love the style of this game. I, it's really good. I saw trailers of this a while back and I was like, wow, that looks, that looks alright. Fool of a took! <laughs> the darkness of the well spot a salty smell in my face. Right. Obviously, you know what that is off, right? Feminist! This unknown symbol let out a powerful aura. Right, we'll get to the front door eventually. I promise. Right, okay, can I walk over there? I can't walk over there, should I, should I say? A lot of people ask me about my accent. Um, it's from the northeast of England, so it's not Scottish, it's not Welsh, it's not Irish. Believe it or not, I'm actually speaking a bit formally compared to some of the people in my, vi in my village. For sale, this board. For sale, this board looked as old as the house. Anybody that knows me will tell you this, that I am speaking a little bit formally sometimes. Anywho! Ooh, is that a drink? Yeah, I'll have that, please. There's still some golden liquid on the gas. Sip it out, man! Oh, what's wrong with you? You need a drink? I think I'm gonna need a drink. need my mouse. The landlord was out so the key might be around somewhere. No one around. Okay. I was all alone with my pain growing and some nausea starting up. Indeed. Don't stop. Think quick. Think well. Can't say anything the wouldn't do. It was just an accident. It happens. The girl must have made it out alive. I had to make it out alive too. I'll find the key and I'll get you back in a sec. The arm came from the marble statue, but there was no key in sight. Right. Okay then. The statue's been moved recently. Okay, dude. Right hand. Ah, here we go. And just like that, we find the key. Twisted. But the dead probably kept the bows away. Okay. I had the feeling I was about to desecrate a sanctuary. <laughs> to open the door to a world I didn't belong to. But whoever lived in there, they would understand. I needed help. Anyone would understand that.
In case you're wondering, I can't sprint. Somewhere safe. That's all that mattered. This is As crazy. the doors opened, the mansion seemed to react to my presence. There was a smell, like a cornered animal. A smell of fear. And yet, I entered the place because I had no choice. I was praying to find a phone or some help. I didn't even bother wondering what happened to prayers when they reached the wrong door. This looks good. This does look good. Do you want to see more? Do you want to see more? Yes, you do. Come back for episode two. All right. Wow. This is so unique. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to leave it there. Thank you very much for coming by. And let me know what you thought of this. Hang on. I'll include this bit for you if this is a good scene. Is it? No, it's not. Alright, join me for the next episode, guys. You've been watching Zinthus. Thank you very much for watching. Check out my Facebook and Twitter. And subscribe for updates if you like. And stay tuned for my upcoming update. And yeah, have a nice night. Bye-bye. <laughs>